My name is Kevin Coleman. I'm a senior product application specialist for our skid steer and compact track loader products at Caterpillar. We've got two new machines, a 255 and a 265 compact track loader. Let's get into them. One of the areas I want to talk to you about is performance. We've optimized our lift linkage to not only give you more lift breakout, tilt breakout, but also lift height. Class leading lift height on the 265 at 11 feet, 132 inches. Class leading lift height on the 255 at 124 inches. We've also got the linkage designed to give you that power to handle those heavier loads, both lifting and tilting. In addition to other performance items, we've got high flow XPS on our new 255 model. That size class is our midsize. It replaces our 259 model and it gives hydraulic performance not seen in this size class before. You've got additional flow and additional pressure out of this mid chassis machine. Something that we previously only offered in a larger class machine, our 289. Again, the 265 model will replace the 289 and that will continue to have that high flow XPS uh, option for that machine. But you don't need the high flow XPS all the time. As a matter of fact, if you want to run some of our attachments that previously maybe you needed the high flow XPS for, like our smart dozer blade as an example, those can be accomplished with our standard flow machines now. You don't have to have that higher system, higher hydraulic system architecture in order to have that function. You can now run all of our attachments uh, that we offer in our smart attachment portfolio off of our standard flow machines. But if you need additional performance, you can take that standard flow machine and you can add our high flow option. We're having a software enabled high flow option that allow you to take that standard flow machine and ramp it up to the additional flow at our standard pressure. And then if you really need the additional performance, again we have our high flow XPS system which gives you that additional flow and extra pressure and that's available for both our 255 and our 265 models. And to back all that up, We've got two brand new engines in our machine, Caterpillar C2.8 liter engines, uh, one with a turbo aftercooled and one turbocharged with significant increases in torque. We're talking about the backup that you need in order to do that work, with the, whether it be with high flow system or a standard flow system to push the piles, lift the loads, power the tools. Okay, one of the, the, the additional things we, we want to point out is our undercarriage design. Uh, we've maintained our torsion suspension undercarriage, which we've featured on our machines for over 20 years, but we've taken that a step further. Now we have a one-piece undercarriage frame design, which gives operators more comfort and more confidence when they're handling heavier loads or maybe even just trying to cut a grade. This one-piece undercarriage design sits more firmly, plants more to the ground, but still gives the comfort that you expect out of a torsion suspension. Other items I point out in the undercarriage, simple things that operators have appreciated, which are tie-downs on the undercarriage frame for easier access there. And then lastly, additional speed. In our 255 model, we've got the capability to go up to 9.1 miles an hour, and that is speed that you can use on the job site. And then back all that performance up with the torque that we talked about in the performance section to push, to give that performance, to push through the pile, to run those attachments, to do the work you need to do. So one of the other topics is comfort. When we talk about comfort, we're talking about a much larger cab than we were previously able to offer in our machines. More foot room, more head room, more hip room, exactly where you want it as an operator to be able to get in the machine and be comfortable. Still feature our independently adjustable arm bar and joysticks so that you can get those in the right position as well. Then you start getting to some of the other creature comforts. Still have cup holders and things of that nature, cell phone pocket, X-mount cell phone holder here as well. But then you start getting into some of the other things. Our eight inch advanced touchscreen monitor. It allows you to uh, have a wide view camera image 
It also has the capability to support our side view cameras, which give you essentially kind of a 270 degree view around the rear of the machine, besides the machine here, so you can see down behind the tracks. And you can couple that advanced touchscreen monitor with our new advanced joysticks. These advanced joysticks allow you to do most every function that you would need to do in the advanced screen monitor from right here on the joysticks. You can navigate the display with uh, the control pad on the right joystick. You can control your auxiliary attachments with one touch control, even for some of our most complex hydromechanical tools. Creep control is also on your joystick. Uh, radio control is also on your joystick. Everything right here at the touch of your button. But to say that the advanced controls uh, are the only option is not true. We do have our standard controls, but our standard controls are anything but basic. Our standard controls on our machine provide the functionality to control every attachment that Caterpillar offers. Couple that with our standard work tool electrical harness, and there's not anything that we offer that you cannot control from those standard joysticks. The advanced joysticks just put more control at your fingertips. We even have easily removable side windows for cleaning. Also have cab four design. A lot of your switches right here on the A pillar, all in this control pad. Uh, a lot of the rocker switches and things that you would have controlled previously have been moved into the integrated monitors, whether it be the standard monitor or the advanced monitor. In addition, uh, some of our packages will have the traditional key start method, but we'll also have a push to start in some of our packages as well. Larger rear window, 59% uh, larger rear window for additional visibility, rear visibility. With some of the changes we've made, we've lowered the engine, we've lowered the cooling pack so that the visibility out of the back of the machine is much improved. 15% 15 uh, 15 additional viewable space out of the overhead window as well. And then automatic temperature control in the cab. So you can very much like your vehicle, set your temperature to a, a certain number and then it will maintain that temperature in the cab through the automatic temperature control. One additional features in the new cab is our high comfort seat. I happen to be sitting in our ventilated heated air ride high back seat. Uh, it has the controls right here on the pods for the air suspension along with the heat and the ventilation. So new high comfort seat, ventilated seat, it takes the air inside the cab, circulates it through the seat. So in the summertime, if you're running your air conditioning, it'll be cooled. In the wintertime, if you're running your heat, it will take that air and it'll be warmed. So very excited about this new seat. We also feature our air ride seats that uh, we had previously in our, in our series that we're replacing with these machines which are our high back air ride seats that are just heated but not ventilated. So lots of options for our customers, has lots of adjustments. You can adjust not only the seat forward and backward, but you can also adjust the cushion forward and backward, the cushion height. Uh, you can recline the seat. Lots of adjustments here in the seat to keep the operator comfortable for those long days. And entry and exit into the machine has also changed with the new cab. We've made entry and exit even easier from the standpoint of the prog progression from the ground up into the cab, but we've also made it easier because our door opens regardless of the position of the attachment. If you've got an uneven ground underneath it, you've got a larger attachment, you can still have the door open even if you have that larger attachment and the arms are raised slightly, you can get out of the machine. And then on top of that, the door is easily removable. So if you want to remove the door for a particular application or maybe even just a nice day, it's very easy to remove that door. For additional information on our CAT 255 and 265 compact track loaders, visit cat.com, visit your local CAT dealer, or visit us on YouTube on our CAT landscaping and construction page. Thanks for joining us.